What's up guys, welcome to today's video and it's the 26th of December and it snowed a bucket load last night and this is a Christmas miracle, this is all I wanted from Christmas is a little bit of snow because I love snow, it's frozen water, water is my favourite thing and yes, I'm loving it, having a great time, I'm going to take you on a day in a life while we're here in Iceland, it's the 26th. Um, in Iceland they celebrate mainly the 24th and 25th, so today's kind of a normal day. Um, so yeah, I'm going to uh, go on a little walk now and have some fun. There's just something really peaceful about the snow. I wasn't planning on going on a walk, but I just really wanted to. I mean, it's just so beautiful anyway. This is just a normal street, and I'm just not used to the snow. I don't think I saw snow until I was like 15, and it was in England, it comes so sparingly, it never really does properly sit on the floor, so. This is just like a little <laughs> a little miracle for me. So um, the river is just over there. So we're gonna go check that out and uh, yeah, I'll show you I'll show you a bit more of this lovely little town. So just heading up to the river here. So it's actually 12.30 and uh, I've only been up for an hour and a half because there's only four hours of daylight. Uh, in Iceland during the winter because it's so close to the North Pole and your circadian rhythm like I said in the other video is just messed up because I wake up with the sun really and uh, I have not been waking up I've been, been going to bed at like 2 a.m. which I never do I usually go to bed at a reasonable time about 11 wake up about 7 or average but recently it's just been messed up but you know it's Christmas time once we get back we'll get to back to a normal sleepy schedule but um, let's go check this river it's absolutely so it's about minus six at the moment I've come out of trainers no gloves just got a t-shirt under here not the best idea I wasn't planning on coming on a walk um, on a little adventure, um, but good news, I have actually found a gym. Well, it's not really a gym, it's a farmhouse basement with a barbell as weight. Uh, it's one of Domi's brother's friends, um, and it's really good just to get some compound lifts in, but this is the best we can do at the moment. So take the bands down there, I'll show you that later. Uh, we're gonna go do a workout. Me and, her brother, uh, me and her brother, so that's going to be good, but it's getting really cold right now. I was going to make some snow angels, um, but it's freezing, and uh, we'll save them later, so uh, let's make snow angels. Ah, <sighs> oh, this was a bad idea, it's very, very cold, and ah, I'm already wearing a t-shirt. There's my half snow angel with my phone in the ground, brilliant. Right, I need to, I need to stop being an idiot. I just get really <laughs> excited in the snow. Um, but I'm gonna head back now, get down me, and we're gonna go on a little adventure. So, oh, it's cold, <laughs> I'm gonna get back. So, unfortunately, the drone decided to commit suicide earlier. We were flying it on those last few clips, which you saw and we lost connection and it just decided to nosedive into the ground. So yes, um, it's been better days. So no more drone footage for the rest of the trip, but it's all right, we'll uh, hopefully get it fixed because this is a complete malfunction, not user error, but it wasn't even that cold. But uh, yeah, sad times, but uh, hopefully we'll get it sorted soon. But uh, yeah, let's get back to our adventure. Oh! And we're in the car with Domi, sister, and Anto. <laughs> <laughs> uh, we're just on a little adventure. Gonna go for a nice little walk and uh, get nice and cold. You ready? Let's go. 
So nice little walk in the cold. <laughs> but um, yes, it's beautiful. It is beautiful. Sure, and it's beautiful. Well, oh, I nearly fell. But uh, <laughs> here we go. Look at this. Absolutely okay. stunning. Now from the uh, -hoo, previous clip. Unfortunately, you know that Dronamin died. Very sad. So there's going to be no drone shots of this beautiful place, unfortunately. Um, but I'm going to try and get it fixed now. Um, but yeah, it's absolutely beautiful. Oh, heck, it's cold. Yeah. Heck. 24. This is like four hours of daylight, and it's always golden now. So it's beautiful. It's beautiful. It's beautiful. Hey, beautiful. Where are we going? Up the hill. Oh, oh. Hi. One, two, one, two. Oh my God, look at that sunset. Absolutely beautiful. It is really cold. Oh. Come here. Come it's here. It's actually freezing. Oh. My face is so cold. I don't think we can actually be out here too long. We are underprepared, even though I'm wearing so many layers. But uh, yeah, we're gonna get to the top of the mountain, well, hill, <laughs> and see what it looks like. All right, this doesn't actually do the gradient justice, but this is pretty steep. I mean, oh, let's get to the top. It's gonna be worth the view. Gonna be taking some pre-workout as we're about to head to well I say the gym but all it is is a bar in a farmhouse somewhere with some weight but we haven't got much to go with now so we're gonna do this and so I'm taking the pre-workout by my protein the goat pre-workout basically my go-to and I don't travel anywhere without it so I'm just gonna take it straight to the dome Oh. <laughs> no matter how nice Ooh. the pre-workouts are, doing it like that will always make your eyes water. Mm. But anyway, let's get to the gym. Oh, all right, guys, here we are. I'm here with Rafi, uh, Domi's brother. He's just warming up on squats. It's very cold in here. Not sure if you can see my voice. See my voice, see my breath, but yeah, this is pretty much it. It's a bench with a rack and a couple of barbells and some weights. Pretty awesome. So, like I said, I'm gonna do full body workouts because I don't know when I'm gonna train while I'm over here. So everything's just full body. We're starting with legs, then we're gonna work our way up. Uh, doing chest, shoulders, back, arms. It's gonna be high volume, doing as much as we can within the hour and just having a good time. So let's get to it. All right, starting with front squat, got 120 on here, three sets, eight reps, let's give it a go. Ooh. So the front squats are feeling pretty good. So this is actually my what sixth, fifth set, my last set, working up to 140 now. Gonna go to failure. Let's see what happens. Ooh, ooh. Alright guys, that's 
Squats done, now we're doing a superset on bench press, so I'm doing 130, six reps into flies with 15s with the flat, fat grips into uh, dumbbell standing spin press. So it's gonna be an interesting one. Ah, wish me luck. <clears throat> Section. So we're doing deadlift rows. So you're doing two reps in the deadlift, into, sorry, two reps in the row into a deadlift, into double dumbbell pullover, three sets. This will really test your back and your group strength. So let's get to 12. <clears throat> Back now, we're just going to finish on a shoulder and arm giant set. So, we're doing four exercises back to back. It's going to be tough, it's like two degrees in here, that's why we're keeping all our clothes on. But, you ready? Let's do it. Thank you. 
And then my friends, that's the workout. Ah, I'm done. All right guys, so we're done. We're gonna head home now. I'll literally show you what this is. This is, I don't know, it's gonna go pitch black in a minute. Uh, but it's literally just an old farmhouse. Let me get the light. There we go. You can turn off. We're uh, coming out into literally snow. And we're basically in the middle of nowhere. As far as you can see, it's just fun. And here's the car. Oh, Alright guys, and that is the workout. How was it? Good. It was good. Great. Good pump. Luckily his mates have let us use the equipment while we've been here um, over the last couple of days. Well, I've just been doing full body workouts like this because we don't know when we're actually going to be able to train because um, I'm traveling and uh, yeah. But now we're just going to go back and spend some time with Domi's family, play some games, watch a movie um, and have a good time because it's Christmas. It's all about taking a little bit of downtime. But anyway guys, I hope you enjoyed this vlog, just a day in the life here in Iceland over Christmas. Um, and if anything, thanks for watching. Subscribe, like, and I'll see you in the next one. Take care.